In layman's terms, contingency analysis is a what-if scenario simulator that evaluates, provides, and prioritizes the impacts on an electric power system when problems occur. A contingency is the loss or failure of a small part of the power system E.GA transmission line, or the loss failure of individual equipment such as a generator or transformer. This is also called an unplanned outage. Contingency analysis is a computer application that uses a simulated model of the power system to evaluate the effects and calculate any overloads resulting from each outage event. Contingency is defined as a foreseen or unforeseen event that happens in the power system for a certain period of time, which refers to the loss or outage of one or more power system components. Contingency analysis provides an indicator of the possible state of the power system at the time of an equipment or component failure in the power system. It functions primarily as a software program that is run in a power management system, simulating a hypothetical test on a set of instances that would result in power flow, voltage, or reactive power violations in the system. Hence, contingency analysis is performed on a list of potential outages. The contingency ranking approach is used to identify these cases and rate them according to their severity. Maintaining power system security is one of the challenging tasks for the power system engineers. The security assessment is an essential task as it gives the knowledge about the system state in the event of a contingency. Contingency analysis technique is being widely used to predict the effect of outages like failures of equipment, transmission line etc., and to take necessary actions to keep the power system secure and reliable. The offline analysis to predict the effect of individual contingency is a tedious task as a power system contains large number of components. Practically, only selected contingencies will lead to severe conditions in power system. The process of identifying these severe contingencies is referred as contingency selection and this can be done by calculating performance indices for each contingencies. It is well known that power system is a complex network consisting of numerous equipments like generators, transformers, transmission lines, circuit breakers, etc. Failure of any of these equipments during its operation harms the reliability of the system and hence leading to outages. Thus one of the major agenda of power system planning and its operation is to study the effect of outages in terms of its severity. Installation of redundant generation capacity or transmission lines is essential in order to make the system run even when any of its components fails. But, power system being dynamic in nature does not guarantee that it will be 100% reliable. Further, such arrangement may not be cost-effective. Hence, a detailed security assessment is essential to deal with the possible failures in the system, its consequences, and its remedial actions. This assessment is known as Power System Security Assessment. Power System Security involves system monitoring where the real-time parameters of the system are monitored by using the telemetry systems or by the SCADA systems. It then involves the most important function of contingency analysis where the simulation is being carried out on the list of credible outage cases so as to give the operators an indication of what might happen to the power system in an event of unscheduled equipment outage. This analysis forewarns the system operator and allows deciding some remedial action before the outage event. For a power system to be secure, it must have continuity in supply without a loss of load. For this security analysis is performed to develop various control strategies to guarantee the avoidance and survival of emergency conditions and to operate the system at lowest cost. Whenever the pre-specified operating limits of the power system gets violated the system is said to be an emergency condition. These viola violations of the limits result from contingencies occurring in the system. Thus, an important part of the security analysis revolves around the power system to withstand the effect of contingencies. The system security assessment process is carried out by calculating system operating limits in the pre-contingency and post-contingency operating states at an operation control center or at the energy management system EMS of the utility company. The contingency analysis is time-consuming as it involves the computation of complete AC load flow calculations following every possible outage events like outages occurring at various generators and transmission lines. This makes the list of various contingency cases very lengthy and the process very tedious. In order to mitigate the above problem, automatic contingency screening approach is being adopted which identifies and ranks only those outages which actually causes the limit violation on power flow or voltages in the lines.
The contingencies are screened according to the severity index or performance index where a higher value of these indices denotes a higher degree of severity. Contingency analysis in power systems is a critical process used to predict and evaluate the impact of potential failures or outages on the electrical grid. It involves simulating various what-if scenarios, such as the failure of a generator, transmission line, tra transformer, or load, to understand the effects on the system's stability and reliability. Here's a breakdown of the key aspects of contingency analysis, predicting equipment failure, it helps in predicting the failure of equipment or specific lines and taking corrective actions before the system becomes unstable. Security performance indices, these are used to assess the safety of the power system and rank contingencies based on their severity. Outage simulation, by simulating outages, contingency analysis examines the effects on the system, such as load flow or short circuit impacts after removing components like transformers, buses, and lines. Lines. Corrective actions, the analysis helps in determining the necessary steps to mitigate the consequences of a particular outage. System security, it ensures that the power system can detect disturbances and analyze their impact, maintaining the system's security. In essence, contingency analysis is a proactive tool that power system operators use to ensure the grid remains stable and secure even in the face of unexpected events. It's an essential part of maintaining uninterrupted power supply and preventing blackouts. Contingency analysis Contingency creation, selection, and evaluation are the three main divisions of contingency analysis. Many studies have focused on contingency selection, primarily with the goal of reducing the extensive list of contingencies by choosing those outages with serious limit violations. The individual outages are then evaluated using load flow. The activity will continue until there have been no post-contingency violations. Contingency creation It is the first stage of the contingency analysis process. It consists of every possible scenario of contingency that might occur in a power system. This process consists of making contingency lists. Contingency selection The process of determining severe contingencies from anything that might lead to a violation of bus voltages and power is the second stage of contingency analysis. The least severe contingency is rejected in this approach, and the most severe disruptions are considered instead. The performance index has been utilized in this procedure to identify the worst ones. Contingency evaluation The process of determining severe contingencies from anything that might lead to a violation of bus voltages and power is the second stage of contingency analysis. The least severe contingency is rejected in this approach, and the most severe disruptions are considered instead. The performance index has been utilized in this procedure to identify the worst ones. Most common types of contingencies in power system, there are several contingency scenarios, but the most common ones are listed below. 1. Loss of transmission component. 2. Loss of generating unit. 3. Equipment failure. Various operating state and power system, contingency analysis involves the power system to operate into four operating states. 1. Pre-contingency In this condition, the power system is in prior to any contingency. It is the most cost-effective option, but it may not be the most secure. 2. Post-contingency The status of the power system after a contingency has occurred, it is considered that this condition has a security violation, such as a line or transformer over its flow limit, or a bus voltage exceeding its limit. 3. Security dispatch It is the condition of the system with no contingency but with operational parameter modifications to account for security violation. For secure post-contingency this is the state in which the contingency is corrected and applied to the base operating condition. Necessity of contingency analysis, improving system reliability, in a developing country like India, we are already facing huge amount of load shedding. There have been a number of reforms in the power sector in India. But government reforms failed to bring desired improvements in the power sector. On the other hand, we are losing transformers and generators for security violation or for some overload problem or a bus voltage outside the limit. It means that if we aren't able to maintain our existing generator or network properly it might be a great loss of our valuable property. For secured operation, as we can determine early by using this method that which components are risky and have probability to fail in near future so we can be more aware about those components and can take additional steps of maintenance to protect it.
That means, we can operate components of the power system more safely and effectively utilizing this analysis. For future planning and expansion, if fault occurs in any transmission line then the load flow through the rest of the lines in the system and this process will increase pressure on those lines. To avoid such problem we can run contingency analysis helps us to expand transmission line and improve future power system.